In this new box set from Plastics Manufacturer, you get 8 identical sprues, each containing 5 figures, 12 different heads with very expressive faces, various arm and weapon combinations including a push dagger, wide bladed kyber swords, muskets, gisales and some Martini Henry rifles, so plenty of variety and all produced to a very good standard. To aid assembly, the various left and right arm combinations are numbered to match, e.g. 2L and 2R, a simple but effective method to avoid the frustration of struggling to match up arm combinations correctly on the first attempt. In addition to the edged weapons and firearm armed combinations, one separate musket, Giselle and Martini Henry rifle are also included on each sprue so you can be attached to the shoulder straps moulded to several of the figures for more variation. And there are also scabbarded swords that can be added to firearm equipped figures to increase their battlefield versatility. I did notice one very minor issue, namely that the right arm identified as 8R has a rolled up sleeve but there is no similarly rolled up left arm. The only figure I didn't really like was the one in the running pose, his legs are so wide apart that his right foot will overlap the 20mm round bases that people often use. I should add that I was pleased that the sprues had been designed so at the points where the sprue connects to the figure there was minimal details that might be damaged when removing components. To sum up, you get 40 good quality figures perfect as your core troops with plenty of options to individualise them. You will need to purchase some metal command packs but given the savings made by buying these core plastic troops that shouldn't break the bank. Anyone interested in the Northwest Frontier in the colonial period should certainly give these figures a try. This video has been brought to you by WI Prime, Wargames Illustrated Magazine's online members club. View more videos or find out more about WI Prime by following these links.